My name is Theo Janssen. I'm a kinetic sculptor. My sculptures are made of very light materials and they are powered by the wind. A part of me is an engineer who wants to map the progress of mobility. Another part is an artist who wants to sculpt the air that surrounds us and give it shape. And always I strive to push the boundaries of what we know and what seems possible to us at this moment in time. The walls between art and engineering exist only in our minds. new forms of life and these are made of this kind of tube, electricity tube, we call it in Holland and uh, we can start a film about that and we can uh, see a little bit backwards in time. Eventually these beasts are going to live in herds on the beaches. 
Theo Janssen is working hard on this evolution. I want to put this uh, forms of life on the beaches and they should survive over there on their own in the future. Learning to live on their own and it will take a couple of more years to let them walk on their own. The mechanical beasts will not get their energy from food, but from the wind. The wind will move feathers on their back, which will drive their feet. The beast walks sideways on the wet sand of the beach, with its nose pointed into the wind. As soon as it walks into either the rolling surf or the dry sand, it stops and walks in the opposite direction. Evolution has generated many species. The Animaris currens ventosa. This is a herd, and it is built according to uh, genetical codes, and this is a sort of race, and each, any, every animal is different, and the, the winning code will multiply. This is a, a wave going from red to right, you can see in this one. And now it goes from, yes, now it goes from left to right. And this is a new generation, a new family, which uh, is able to store the wind. So the wings pump up air in lemonade bottles, which are on top of that, and, um, and they can use that energy in case the, race, the wind falls away and the, the tide is coming up and they still have a little bit of energy to reach the dunes and save their lives, because they are drowned very easily. I could show you this animal. So the proportion of the tubes in this animal is very important for the, 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 the walking. There are 11 numbers, which are called the 11 holy numbers. These are the distances of the tubes which makes it walk that way. In fact, it's a, it's a new invention of the wheel. It works the same as the wheel. The axis of a wheel is staying on the same level.